Welcome back to The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt Part 12, I think we're now on. Um, I took last week off, I've been very, very busy. You might have noticed, I haven't replied to many comments. I hope to get back to that soon. Maybe I'll just reply to a few here and there. But no, we uh, we took last week off just because Let's I've been very busy. Um, no, we'll try the lamp in a minute, Geralt. God. So impatient. Everyone else is telling me to go too. No, so. We, uh, yeah, we took last week off. I realized something recently and I thought... You know, I really do enjoy playing The Witcher 3 on these playthroughs, but I'm especially looking forward to when I can get back to Toussaint, because I, I feel as if I haven't been there in a long time. Like, a lot of my videos don't really take place there and stuff, and I'm very much looking forward to it. So I want to explore here first, because I think it gives me all the dialogue options and stuff. Hello. Oh. Uh, that stench. Oh, okay. Hang on. Wait, we got the- Can we- Oh my god, we can fight with the lamp out. We need to put the lamp back in. Right, right, hold up. Right, we're, we're a little bit out of practice, I'm gonna be honest, it's been a while. We took, yeah, as I said, yep, last week off. So no, we're gonna explore the tower, continue with this quest today. I don't really have, like, a set plan for what I'm gonna do, but I'm, oh, God, but I'm just gonna sort of, sorry, I'm just gonna try and continue with what I'm doing. So there is a body here. I what led them here, hunger or greed. The game's quite loud for me, so I hope that's not picking up on the mic, but we'll see at the end. It, it, it kind of just sort of trumps it anyway, because I sink them. Relic oil! Ooh, I don't really use oil? Oh, wow, okay. Um, I much prefer the Quen stuff, but, you know, it's still cool. So this is all the, the pestery summony things. So I want to explore all round here first, just so I don't miss any dialogue options or things. So it's telling me to... I wonder if I can actually use the lamp outside. I don't think I ever have even bothered before. Um, flawless Sapphire. See, this is why you have to loot, guys. Will the magic lamp give me anything out here? I guess I may as well just sort of equip it. Why can't I equip it? There we go. Just in case. You know, we can run around with it a bit. Can we not? There you go. Oh, okay, that's not going to work. Tell you what, we're putting the lamp back in, guys. We just have to search manually. Oh, God, how do I unequip? Right. <laughs> That's so annoying. There is actually some greeny, glowy th stuff over here that it looks like we may be able to check out. Millie, we got to flee. Quick now. Millie. M Millie, what's with you? I don't know. So, uh, burn it. Ah! What? No. No. Stay back. Don't leave me. Right then. And we do get extra experience for doing this, so you know what? Cool. So that's his bones. Lovely. Um, anything else around here? I think that was just the one. I've actually never seen that before. I never really bothered to properly go around here and explore. I just normally sort of was like, okay, killed the hag in the tower. You know... What's next? I think we got almost everything, don't we? There's one more chest, it looks like. See, this is why I gotta search everywhere, guys. Look how much stuff I'm getting. When I go to make the armor that I'm gonna make, my Witcher School of Choice, I'll have so much stuff. And isn't that cool? I like the armor I'm currently wearing. I kinda wanna keep it till we get to Corvo Bianco, or whatever it's called. I, I love it. I think it's so cool. It reminds me of the Witcher 2 starting armor. If you're a scrub and you didn't get the Raven's armor, which one? Save carry. Like, we did! That's right, no. <laughs> right, we need, we need to... Didn't come here to ask nicely. You don't say, Geralt. I mean, you know, you'd have to be brave to do what Geralt does, right? As many dead as alive. I mean, obviously, but you know what I mean, if you actually think about it. Okay. Well, there's still lots of lovely big old rats here. I would I would hate to be in the situation Geralt's in now. I mean, obviously anyone would, but I mean, just because of the rats. I'm not a big fan of rats or mice. I don't like their tails. Creeps me the hell out. Um, honestly, fine with spiders. There was this thing when I was younger where to overcome fears and stuff, you had to put like a spider on your face. A lot of people didn't do it. I did it. I know, weird, weird flex thing, but no, but I mean as in, spiders don't bother me, but if you ask me to touch a rat or something, I just, I, I'm not a fan of rats and Where stuff like that. Noble? Just the tails. Lying here, quiet as a mouse. Head split open like a rotted pumpkin. More like a peasant now. 
sloshing around in his own blood and shy. Be nothing noble about him. Too quick a death they gave him. Should have been made to suffer. He's not the end of it. Sons can suffer for him and the daughter. To the top! Okay. I love how you get extra experience for trying to solve, you know, experience the story more. Okay, that's nice. Blood. Many must have died here. I'm trying to think of a bit in The Witcher that genuinely creeped me the hell out. Right, I'm going in, I'm going in, okay? What? So, I know we are meant to be going up, but I'm... Is there wraiths down here or something? I'm concerned. Uh, sorry, but I'm trying to think. I know there's a bit in The Witcher that's actually quite creepy. I think it... Oh, is it the iris bit, maybe, I'm thinking of? Like, much later on. Oh my god, the silver! Anything up there? There is actually something up there, but... We can't jump. Is it because we're holding the lamp? Yay. So we can ignite that, but it seems a tad pointless. There is another chest down here. Some lovely cotton. Anything else down here? I honestly wouldn't mind doing two of these parts a week. I, I really, Which really enjoyed recording them. <laughs> I might do that, you know. We'll see. Let them out, maybe. Like to die of hunger if we leave them there. I'd sooner burn the vermin. Releasing them's not like to bring no good. Imagine the harm they'd do if they swam back to the village. Swam? Rats? I was gonna say. How do you figure they'd do that? You needn't fret for them. Clever little bastards. Clever in you. Hmm. They seem sluggish to you. Got the mange, maybe? Oh, and that stench! Oh, well, okay then. Uh, anything else down here? It looks like I think that's everything in the bottom floor. Unless there's something hidden under the stairs. Classic hidden under the stairs play. I actually can't wait to get to Novigrad either. And, well, either and deal with the crime bosses and stuff and do little contracts. Oh, I really... This game is unbelievably good if you think about it. I mean, it, it is unbelievably good. Like, there's no game like The Witcher. No, no game has even come... Like, Red Dead's the closest, but even that, I prefer this setting so much more. Peasants are not here of them again. That simpleton turned your head, but one Graham hardly makes the rest courtly, one and all. My lord, peasants. Don't start, Annabelle. Back to your craft. Always bending my ear about fool peasants. I'm not here of them again. That simpleton turned your head, but one Graham hardly makes the rest courtly. Don't start, oh, for God's sake. Sorry, sorry. I, um, I think it's because I'm turning away. I'm not completing this thing, so... <laughs> you know, sorry about that. The previous Lord of Velen guys, by the way, there on the right, before the Baron took over, he sort of fled here with his family, and the Baron just sort of walked into Crow's Perch. Um, pretty interesting. Little sort of flies and stuff everywhere. Right, let's have a look around. Did, did that chair just move, or was... was Okay. I don't know. That was weird. Um, there's another skeleton. Keep just slowly heading up on the tower. Oh, it's so... Okay. Oh, hello. Was that part of the lantern, or not? I'll have a quick look outside. Could be some interloot. Oh yeah, people keep on telling me to sell all the hides. I do actually read a lot of the comments. Like, as the video comes out, I read them. I just don't reply to them that because I, it just- it takes a while to think of stuff, you know? And and I, I like- I sort of think of the reply in my head and then I just forget and stuff. I'm, I'm gonna try and get to that now. Actually, after this video, maybe. Strange is still here. The noble died a time ago. Who's that? Show yourself. Anyone there? Viserad down there? Who? Who are you? Oh no, that's he died, and he got killed by well, we can assume what, but we'll leave that for now. God, we're getting so many experience points from this. Just looking at little things. I mean, I'm not sure what 80 really equates to. 
Enhanced cursed oil. We're getting so many oils. We don't want oil. I, I could just make it just, you know, just cause. But we'll see. I mean, it, it, I'm not saying it's not useful. I'm just saying that there's other stuff that I would prefer to use in combat as opposed to messing around with that. But I suppose if I make the oil, then I just have it and it replenishes every time I rest anyway. So it might be worth it. I'm not sure if the more alchemical stuff you have, the more strong alcohol that's used or if it's just one strong alcohol every time. I mean, I pick up all the alcohol anyway, and I don't think it weighs anything, so not that much of an issue. Have you not seen the at the top of the tower yet? Nearly. I'm at the top. Nothing here that looks like a laboratory. Then you've not reached the highest level. Look for a passage. Hmm. Someone dragged something across the floor. Moore dragged it from one wall to the other, repeatedly. Okay. Oh, we're coming up to a fight soon, aren't we? Sorry, I'm just going to check something, because I always forget whether or not... Because, yeah, I am on Death March. I'm just making sure. And also, the autosave is really high. Um, so we're turning that down. And also, I'm just going to check... Yeah, Gwent's on hard. I never change it or anything, because otherwise I wouldn't get any achievements or anything. But, um... Can I inspect the handprint or not? I don't think so. But, you know, it's just in case. You never know. Could have just messed up and then I'm not playing. You know what I mean? Like, I don't really cut these videos that much. At least, I cut them a little bit, but not loads. So you'd sort of see if I wasn't on death march. But I always am. There's no point going off it. Pretty well equipped, too. Oh, so many oils. This is like oil city. Uh, hmm. I'm going to investigate these things first. Experimenting on humans. Never would have gotten away with it if the Conclave were still in charge. Oh, that's a nice noise, isn't it? I kind of wanted to investigate a bit mean? more. You claim to love me. I'm cold. Why has no one come for me? I cannot leave this place. I see no way out. Who are you? Do you seek to hurt me as well? Want to play some Gwent? No, I'm just, um, no need to fear me. I'm a witcher. We'll say this. Don't be afraid. I want to lift the curse that grips this island. Your turn to tell me who you are. The other ghosts, they couldn't see me. I'm special. Always was. The rare beauty. The Lord's daughter. These lands, as far as the eye can see, were ours. My family and I were hid in the Mage's Tower to await the war's end, the end of hard times. It was not to be forever. Mage who lived here, who was he? Alexander? I hardly knew him. He spent most of his time locked away in this tower. He's dead too, you know. They're all dead. Mountains of corpses, yet I stand here alone, all alone. They've all abandoned me. Even he who promised me everlasting love. You will abandon me as well. If I can lift the curse, you yourself will be free to leave. Tell me what happened here. Peasants sailed to the island to ask for food. Is that true? No. They came to rob and kill. They thought us rich, believe we'd stowed ourselves away here to laugh at their misery. Yet we had little food as well. Too little to share with those who came. They slaughtered everyone. I heard my father cry out, but the mage told me not to reveal myself or let anyone in. He gave me a potion. If I was discovered, I was to drink it. He said everything would be all right. What happened then? Fear. Terrible fear. I feared the men who approached, but I also feared the potion drinking it. Didn't trust the mage? In the village, they claimed he meddled in disease. Not curing it, but causing it. They said he lured rats into the tower, infected them with the Catriona. Only rumours, surely, but I was afraid. So horribly afraid. And then I heard him. My beloved Graham. 
He called to me. I opened the door for him, but others rushed in. They lunged at me and... and... Your beloved failed to save you. Why? There were too many. Leave her be, he shouted. He grabbed at them, tried to stop them. They just laughed. Did they hurt you? They gripped my arms, tore at my dress. I managed to free myself and drink the potion, and then... nothing. Poisoned? That how you died? No. For I later awoke. I was alone, it was dark. Only there were rats. Everywhere. Dozens. Hundreds. And I... couldn't move. Sleeping potion. Effects hadn't worn off yet. You were paralyzed. They were everywhere. All over me like insects. My face, my hands. I felt them rip open my skin, then crawl into my stomach. They tore me apart, and I could not even scream. Have I not suffered enough? Why can't I leave this place? Hmm. Can you talk to the island's other specters? No, I'm alone here. The others, they flee when they see me. I know not why. You do not fear me, do you? No. Used to dealing with ghosts. Though, gotta admit, there's something about you. You're different. You weren't the last to die on this island. Found a fresh corpse in the tower. The island's a dangerous place. Folks should not venture here. I too wish to leave. The dead man. Looked like a monster had attacked him, recently. The tower home to anything else? How am I to know? There's lots of wraiths here. I, I, I hear them whispering every night. Not talking about ghosts. A monster who hunts here. You must have noticed something. I don't know. I've noticed naught. Why do you ask? Why must you press me so? You're to be my savior, not my tormentor. Hmm. The plot thickens. <laughs> How can I help you? A curse born of hatred binds me to this place. Only love's power can hope to lift it. But who could love a race? And your beloved, he dead too? Grail. No, he lives. I would know if he died. But he fled and abandoned me. Left me here all alone. Maybe you could strip the curse of its power by forgiving him. You might cleanse the isle. Your beloved, who is he? A noble son? No, a poor fisherman. My father objected, strongly. He did not see us together. I miss him so. Each night I walk to the island shore to gaze upon the village. Does he remember me still? Said before you can't leave the tower. Did I? You must have missed that. I don't think so. I... I don't know anymore. It's all a nightmare to me. As I see it, you're the curse's focus. The other ghosts on the island, their auras aren't nearly as strong as yours. My medallion started pulsating as soon as we started talking. I don't know what you mean, but you do seem to know some things. You could be right. My fate is tied to the Isle, I feel that. Perhaps because I am heiress of these lands. It could be your blood ties to the land, the base of the curse that is. If so, forgiving Graham, laying your resentment to rest should lift it. I loved him. I'm prepared to forgive him. But I must know that he regrets what he did. Take my bones to him. He must bury them. This will be our farewell. Will you speak to him? Will you do this for me? Um, hmm. 
Okay, so some of you might have never actually seen the second option, which is not sure if I trust you, and you actually only get this option if you find the fresh corpse in the tower, otherwise you can just say fine, and then, or, and then do what she says, or you can just say need to look around and leave the tower, then it kicks off what this second option would do anyway, but because I've looked at the body and stuff, I can actually say the second option as opposed to the first, and I'm actually gonna do that because I don't trust her at all. <laughs> really sad story. But something's not right. Got a feeling. What is it? You're not telling me everything. You know the island's dangerous, but refuse to tell me about the monster that lives here. There is no monster. Um. Got a feeling you might be lying. I think you're lying. Question is, why? To protect the beast? Or is it that... Stop! I will not hear this! I can't help you. Taking anything off this cursed island, from any cursed place, just too dangerous. And a dead woman's bones, that's asking for trouble. They said witches are heartless beasts. Will you bring Graham here then? I so long to say goodbye. Annabelle, listen. You never wish to help me, and here I have someone who would finally take pity on me. Here we go. Quen. Uh, uh. Oh my god, that Quen. If I hadn't Quen then. Okay. I kind of want to loot the rest of this tower. I guess we can come back and do it after. Fuck off, rats. Yeah, we'll go and kill the Plague Maiden in a second. Just want to... Loot some more of his notes. We'll read the logs after if you want, guys. If I remember. Um, <laughs> I'm just quickly looting the rest of the tower. <laughs> just, you know, I'm well, while I'm here. We'll, we'll go and get the plague made in a sec. The end. What a shitty way to die. Oof. So, I think there is something out here, right? Oh my god. Okay, it's fine. Devil's Puffball. See, we're getting all the diagrams, guys. Just no um, enhanced swallow, which is kind of what we want the most. But it's fine. I think this place has now been fully looted. We've we've had a glance around. There is a door down here. Right, let's go get the Plague Maiden. Okay. Yeah, I had to do this all fairly recently for my Plague Maiden video. Maybe like a, maybe a month ago now? I don't know how long ago that was. But I did skip through all of the dialogue and everything. Um... Because I knew that I would getting up to well, I knew I was getting up to it in the playthrough pretty soon, and um, I do that with most of the videos I record when I have to get uh, stills of things, just because it, it's it's I, I don't like to ruin it because I know I'm going to get to it in the playthrough eventually, and I feel like I want it to be as distant a memory as I can make it, so I I literally just went here, right? Okay, I know where it spawns. Hello there, Pesto. So. God, I can't hit that thing. Wait there. Can I actually set the a pester on fire? I love pesters because they're it's a completely unique monster. I don't think you actually can fight them ever again in The Witcher 3. I think this is the only fight there is with a pester. Come on. Okay. Nearly. A pester. A pester? And did you learn how to lift the curse before you lunged at her sword in hand? Yeah, we talked a bit. Looks like I need to get her beloved to the island. Fisherman named Graham. I know the man. He lives in Oriton, village on the lakeshore. Find him immediately. We're close to unraveling this. I can I wonder if there's anything up here. No. Yeah, well, we're getting close. We have a signpost out here as well, I'm pretty sure, so that's good. Uh, we can just use that. Okay. Right, let's go find Gra Graham. Graham? Great Graham? I felt, Is it Graham or Gra... I think it's Graham, right? So, Oriton. We have actually been to Oriton because we defeated the small child at a game of cars, which was great. 
That was a proud moment in our career. So we uh, we we now just have to talk to Graham about Annabelle. Graham, that's a great name. If I had a son, I'd call him Bruce, just because I could like you know I could get really annoyed at him. Like, come on, Bruce, don't be a dick. I don't even know what I'm saying. I just always think it'd be cool to have a, like, go on, little Brucey. <laughs> just because it's such, like, a like a big dude's name, you know? Hello. What? Have I? Just wondering what you want from him, from Graham. Me? Didn't want nothing. It's his mother be worried about him. He's been locked in his hut since he came back from the aisle. Talks to no soul. Love's misery curdled his brains, I reckon. All right, get out of the way. Ah, ouch. I want to talk. You deaf, damn it! I told you. Who are you? I'm a witcher. Been to Fike Isle. I've been to the island. I know what happened there. What do you want of me? Want to talk to you about Annabelle. Annabelle? What can you know about her? I met her. Talked to her. Annabelle's dead. Drank poison. And I... I couldn't save her. Did you love her? I... Something mad. Loved her so deep I believed we'd come through. Believed we'd be together. Of course, it was not to her father's liking. His daughter in a plain lout. What happened on Fike Isle? You gotta tell me. It were Millie, Finch, and Faulkner. They rallied the men, all roughs, to go to the Isle. Take oh, we saw Millie. The new... He died. They knew I was known at the tower that the <clears throat> Lord's servants would open the gate for me since I sold them fish. They forced you to go with them? No, I... I saw my chance in it for Annabelle and me to flee. But it all spun in a chaos. Our boys from the village, they started killing everyone. Annabelle, they wanted to rape. First, then she drank the poison. Mage must have gave it her. I ran out the tower hollering that I wanted to die, cursing them all to hell. Don't force me to speak of it. No more, please. Said you were hollering as you fled the tower, the island. What exactly did you say? I don't remember. I wanted them to pay for what they'd done to her. Might have cursed them. There's a powerful magic aura on Fike Isle. Passions, evil intent, strong emotions of any kind can activate it. Your words could be the curse's source. She took the poison, because of them. It wasn't poison. Annabelle drank a strong sleeping potion. Mage wanted to protect her, make it look like she was dead. Convinced everyone. That means... Is she... You said you spoke to her? Spoke to her ghost. By the time she awoke, Tower was full of cold corpses. And rats. She was warm meat. Rats ate her alive. She was alive the whole time. But... Can't be. She was cold all through like a corpse. I shook her, begged to open your eyes. I never thought... It's not your fault. No guilt in not knowing. And you couldn't know it wasn't poison she drank. Gods, what have I done? If I had stayed behind to bury her... I didn't notice she was alive. It might have ended different, ended well. If you'd stayed on the island, I doubt you'd have survived. I'd take death over leaving her to the rats like that. <sighs> but there's naught I can do about it now. Wrong on that count. Annabelle needs you. You can help her. She's still there. In the tower. Can I see her? Yeah. One thing you should know, though. In death, Annabelle turned into a pester. A pester? What's that? More than a restless ghost. A plague maiden. A powerful wraith filled with grief and hatred that drive her. Give her the power to sow disease and death. She suffers. 
How am I to help her? Gods know I'm willing. Annabelle thinks you abandoned her. Gods! She hates me. And all this time she's thought I ran, abandoned her. Yes, go to the tower, talk to her. Maybe you can convince her that's not how it was. I thought she died. I'd never have left her there otherwise. A curse has imprisoned Annabelle and the other spirits on the island. Love can shatter its power, free her and them. Just as in the legends. If you know the legends, you know one kiss is enough to break an evil spell. On one condition. That it's a kiss from someone whose love is true. I told you. I said I love her with all my heart. Take me to her, please. It's dangerous. There are risks involved. Understand that, don't you? Of course. I'm no coward. I'll not run this time. Uh, let's go now. Nothing. Let's go. I'm ready. Let's go to the tower. Mm-hmm. Tower full of mice. Oh my god. That was not on purpose. I meant to actually quen up there. I didn't do anything. I've waited long enough for revenge. Okay. Graham, you can come in now. Oh, he's there, okay. He's over there. Uh, uh we want to here. I still hope to Annabelle and me. It weren't impossible. We could have been together and now she's dead. And it's my fault. If only I'd been able to protect her. Yeah, I'm not lead an army of peasants to her house. You can change the past, but you can still help Annabelle to move on, to rest in peace. It's terrifying here. It's too quiet. Chop, chop. Speed up. Let's get this over with. I remember the screams. Inhuman they were. Now it's silent. They're dead. All dead. Don't think about that. Keep walking. Hurry up, Graham. Where even is he? I don't... I, what, Graham? Okay, he'll catch up. It's fine. <laughs> He's gone. He's gone. He's doing his own thing. Right, well, we're there now. You have not forgotten. You've returned for me. Is... is... is that... Don't you recognize me? It's me, Annabelle. The one you abandoned, remember? I was sure you was dead. If I'd known otherwise, I'd never have left you. I'd do anything for you. I would. You know that well. Believe me, I beg you. Prove it. Kiss me. Graham, careful. He's about to get some serious tongue action, guys. At last. The curse is lifted. 
and Graham and Annabella are reunited. Sorry about that, Graham or Graham, I don't know. I'm calling you Graham, screw it. Graham is easier to say. Well, at least that's done. Still only level nine. Whew, well that was a that was a bit of an ordeal, wasn't it, guys? The first half an hour of today's Witcher part, we've um we've had a bit of a, a bit of a thing there, you know? It was cool though. Oh, it's annoying having to go up and down this tower. Ooh, creepy. God, that that I, I always feel bad for the fact that Graham or Graham whatever died. I kind of think she she didn't have to kill him, did she? Oh well. I guess she won him in death. Right, where are we headed? We're going to finish a tower full of mice. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll travel here. We'll read Alexander's notes and then we'll um, walk up to Kira. So, let's have a look. Alexander's notes are in my inventory somewhere. I have like loads of new stuff, don't I? I'm not sure how useful it all is. So, quest items, I don't think his notes are actually quest items, but we have part two and part one. Let's have a look at part one. My experiments continue to, oh wait, day 237. My experiments continue to return results I must consider unreliable. Metho methodological, method <laughs> methodological errors are not at fault. Methodical? Methodological, that is a weird word. Methodological errors are not at fault. The problem lies in the shoddy and valuable, uh, fallible research material I am forced to work with. Despite his prior assurance, Viserad, or Viserad is unable to provide me with enough moderately healthy specimens for my tests. Most of the material is starved and terrified, having been dragged here straight from the dungeon. I waste a great deal of time daily, uh, a great deal of time daily washing and delousing, de, de I guess, then before I will do, s before I will so much as let them step foot into my laboratory. Um, ster sterility, steri sterility, sterility first. I know it's, I know it's the plural of sterile. Well, not, it's like, uh, this is, this is annoying. Sterility first, whatever. As Marty Sodogren managed to prove in her little known work, the attitude of a patient undergoing treatment can have a significant, Im significant impact on battle against the disease. Unfortunately, the volunteers with which I am supplied do not show sufficient comprehension, let alone enthusiasm for the noble work in which they are taking part. In fact, it seems they consider the research part of their punishment. I've tried a few times, though I am but a poor speaker, to convince them that they are contributing to the eradication of one of the greatest plagues tormenting mankind. I had the distinct impression they stood, they understood little, but perhaps their stupor was merely the result of the early stages of the illness. Of course, it is impossible to achieve success without significant sacrifices. The overwhelming majority of them will have to lay down their trifling lives on the altar of learning, but that is a sacrifice I am willing to make. Part one. Part two. Day 346. I never did like rats, not because of their obscene tales, but rather on account of their lively and disturbing intelligence. Hey, see, he has the tail thing too. Okay, sorry. They are always listening when a man believes he is only talking where where he's only sorry where he's talking only to himself. And what's worse, they seem to understand. A few days ago, I caught myself talking to one of them, to a particularly large black male with a torn off ear. At first, I was overcome by panic. Was this a first? Uh, was this a first manifestation of the illness? Of course that was impossible, for I'd fortified my immunity with powerful spells. Upon further consideration, I concluded it was an altogether natural reflex, one even the most learned among us find hard to restrain. We may just like to be listened to. I placed the black rat in a separate cage. The time will come for it to play a part in the tests. Meanwhile, it can keep me company and observe. It noticed I've noticed it looks with great concentration at the cages of its infected brethren, particularly those in the last stages of illness. Fascinating. Speaking of company, I have none besides the black rat and cannot hope for better. Veserad avoids the laboratory and has expressed his desire for his daughter to steer clear me steer clear of me as well. Well, at first I thought he feared a moral scandal, which would be uh, risible in the extreme. Risable? 
Risible, I know. But he explained the true reason in due course. It seems Annabelle has always possessed a fragile psychic constitution. Um, okay. Observing the ill might throw her into foul humours. The peasants taking part in the... Sorry, the peasants taking part in the study have stopped speaking to me. I don't know what they believe... I don't know what they believe this little act of defiance will serve. It does me no harm. They have made for lousy conversation partners. Uh, they made for lousy... whatever. There, there, uh, there remains, of course, the woman, but as for her, I try to limit my contact. Oh, sorry, my phone just went off. <laughs> okay, day 362. My black rat has died today. My black rat has died. Today I found him curled up in his cage. I suspect... I suspected he had become infected on accident, but during the autopsy, I did not uncover any signs of illness. He was also perfectly well fed. Strange. From a medical point of view, his death remains unexplained. Something, which I must admit, irritates the scholar in me. But as mentioned previously, I'm not particularly fond of rats. Right, I think- I don't know if there was another note or anything, but that'll do. Let's go. Kira, we lifted the curse on Fike Isle. We read all the Alexander's notes, at least the ones that we found. Uh, Let's have a chat. We'll cut across. Kira, we have returned. Oh, did I leave this open last time? Geralt, oh, oh well. I, I don't like it. <laughs> um. Tell me more about this mage from the Isle. Were you two close? Never expected you'd take such an interest in my private life. More interested to know if you bonded as fellow magic practitioners. Oh, we had little in common in that arena. Oh, Alexander was one of those anxious experimenters, forever short on sleep. The kind that thinks perfect happiness is an isolated tower and a full set of vials and alembics. Okay. I just want to check if she's actually got any of the... Very uh, much. The oils, not the oils, the other one. Potion stuff. Probably not. Shortler, Northern Wind, then I'm pretty sure everything else is cool. Oh well, right, Fike Isle. Fike Isle's free of its curse. Able to persuade Graham to go to the tower with you? Did you mention there was a pastor involved? He knew the risks, but he'd also heard lots of stories about true love, whose kiss can break any spell. Can't help thinking that gave him courage. And? It ended well? Depends how you look at it. Curse is lifted, Annabelle's spirit is left in peace. But Graham's dead. Oh, poor boy. Still, he's proved that true love may be more common than some suppose. Hmm. One thing's bothering me. What? Annabelle said Alexander was studying diseases. She mentioned Catriona. You knew this? All the mages knew about it. Alexander was a highly regarded epidemiologist. I would have given anything for an opportunity to study his notes, but he guarded them jealously. The lamp. What do you want to do with it? As I said, you may keep it. I don't believe I shall need it anymore, given the aisle's been cleansed. I actually regret not going there with you. Perhaps we can make up for that lost time now. Okay, cool. All right. See ya. Time I was on my way. Perhaps... Perhaps you'd stay just a bit longer? There's one small favor you might yet do for me. What is it? I put in an order for a few substances from Novigrad. The trader was due to be here yesterday, but has yet to arrive. Could you see what happened? The package is rather important to me. Why not? If he was coming here from Novigrad, he must have passed through Black Bell. I'll check the area. Thank you. I shall be ever so grateful. Right, we'll help you out again, Kira. Why not? A service of the witch oh, of the palace. hello. A witcherly service, that's to say. What do you need? Tell me. A man who fears no evil the Pella needs. Forefather's Eve is nigh, with rites to conduct. Wandering souls to emerge, damned souls too. We've the circle to protect from these wretches. <laughs> what do I get out of it? Witches do naught for free, this the Pella knows. Not to fear. How to reward one for their aid. This too the Pella knows. Why hold the ritual at all? At times men die choking with regret. 
At times, death takes them before they've tasted any bitterness in life. These poor souls, unfulfilled, cannot leave this veil of tears. Their spirits wander midst the living, must be judged, sent on their way. This we do on Forefather's Eve. I see. Seems like you could use a witcher, so yeah, I'll help. You'd not refuse, the Pell on you. The time's come to gather the folk. Across the lake we must journey, to Fike Isle. There in the circle of stones we shall meet. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight at midnight. Right, well we've got quite a lot of quests now. We've got Family Matters, which obviously we will do later. We've got Fall of House Rude, yeah. We have Forefathers Eve and a favor for a friend. So, how close is a favor for a friend, actually, now I think about it? It is just up there. Uh, and then Fike Isle is down there. Hmm. I'll tell you what, actually, we're going to do a favor for a friend because I think we end up on Fike Isle anyway, so it doesn't really matter. We could just sort of do that after, if you know what I mean. Maybe we should do some of these question marks first. Hmm. Have a quick look, I suppose. So I'll go up and round, then down and stuff. I have black blood equipped. So it's kind of pointless. Well, I, you know, I think it's all interesting, guys. I think it's all interesting. I think, you know, we've we've been doing a lot so far today. I'm pretty gonna play for another, I don't know, like another 40 minutes or so. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Next marker. I feel like it's good to get these markers just out the way. You know what I mean? Yeah, Archon traveling across Velen alone. Oh. No way that was gonna end well. Have I found Kira's merchant straight away? That was not on purpose. A dry red from Zubaran. Southern slope. Notes of black currant and citrus. Uh, and leftovers and of meat. Heart. Cataplepis. Wonder what spell requires that. Package still intact. Don't sense anything magic, though. Wonder how Kira will explain this one. Human. From an artery. Can't be far. Wouldn't have made it. It. Needed for help. It never came. That's selling for you. Right, well, we did the Kira thing accidentally. Volker, we've hit gold, old friend. Not only have we sold all our stock, we have sold it three times its cost. Our customer wants it all. Wine from Beauclair, everything from Beaujalis Nove Novel to the oldest vintages, white rose, sorry, white, red, rose, you name it. Uh, Cato... Cato... Cato blepas, meat, pickled beef, pepper, cinnamon, cloves. I'm telling you, old friend, everything. There's one catch, however. We must deliver the goods to Velen, to a village called Midcopes. I know, I know, dangerous. What's with, uh, what with the war and all? But think of the coin. I've managed to secure a pass that will get you across the pontar. Then it's just a hop, skip, and jump, and you're there. You'll be fine. <laughs> Claws. P.S. We'll split the proceeds 50-50. Well, that worked out well. Is this the bandit camp, I'm guessing? Okay. I'll tell you what, I think this is time for this. I didn't set anyone on fire, really. Ugh. Oh, what? I got him to- oh my god. Oh, that got him all. Ooh. Seems like a horrible thing to say. Ugh. God, this I should keep this guy alive. He's on my bloody team. Huh. Giving me no choice. A barber? Would he give me a free haircut? We could do with a little beard trim, I feel like. 
Well, that guy nicked his razor. He was having that one. Nilf bastards must have coin coming out their asses. They buy every peasant I capture, no matter if he's lame, cross-eyed, or dumb as a rotten stump. Never haggle, neither. They need folk for the silver mine, they say, and no one ever lasts more than two months there anyway. So every hand helps. Fine by me, business is good. Only thing worrying me is that soon I'll have caught all the peasants around. And then who'll I sell? No idea, mate. God. It's horrible, isn't it? Right. There's so much stuff here. Oh, we found the key. So I'm trying to get to this. Oh, so many pairs of hunting trousers. Okay. Well, maybe that barber can give us a haircut, you know? So I said it before, and I'll say it again. We're going to get a haircut. I don't know. Eventually, we might try and get, like, a little haircut. I kind of like the beard at the moment. We had one beard cut at the start. I feel like it's cool to cut it before you go to each zone. So before I first enter Novigrad, I should have a little beard trim. Or beard trim when I first get there sort of thing. That it sort of shows how it grows over the time. I mean, to be fair, we, we already have, like... Have we got the fullest beard in the game yet? Or is that a little bit more? Not sure. Right, should we... Should we should, I feel like this guy's just watching us sort of go through everything. Oh, I'm, I'm just picking it all up. I guess I can sell everything. Right... Thank you, Master. You saved my life. If you ever come through Claywich, you give us a holler. We'll shave ye and shear ye for free. Sure, why not? Right, we dealt with this place. Where's next? We have quite a few down here. So we did actually... I say we go up there, then we just sort of go around, just clear them up and sort of circle back round. If you get me. We might be able to get to level 11 today, then we can make the armor that we want. You know? No more of this armor. I do like this armor, though. I'll have to store it somewhere, I guess. Yeah, that'd be cool. Right, where's this next place? A hidden treasure. I'm guessing it's... Is it not... It's not guarded, though? Molky, I know you don't smuggle no more, that you've set aside plenty of coin and ain't interest in the risk. Just want to enjoy time with your wife and kiddies, but I gotta ask you for a favor. We gotta move one more load, and it's the last, I promise. It's a simple job, couple of chests, risks minimal, and the reward's substantial. Please do it, if not for the gold, then for at least old time's sake. But... Oh, it's in the water. Right, let's go grab it. Oh, Geralt is just up for anything, isn't he? He's like, you know what? Middle of the ocean. Well, middle of a little bit. I'm going to go there. I'm going to dive. Oh, God, this is the worst. Can I attack? I don't think I can. I hate drowners. Okay, well, we got them. Um, Is it down here? Whoa, what the hell is this? That was so weird. That was the bloody treasure? A long sword? What the hell? Pointless. Oh god, I actually need to resubmerge. There probably is more down here. Just give me a second. There's no way it was just a... Wait there. We'll go back down. It's pretty much directly down from where we are, so we should be fine. Is there really nothing else? Was that it? Doesn't look like there's anything else, does there? God, that, that was absolutely terrible. We're not even... How are we not level 10 yet? We finished the Pester Quest. Did every single ghost. I have no idea. I don't think there's anything else here. That was terrible. That was a terrible sunken treasure. What? Uh, crates filled with gold. There was a Nilfgaardian bloody longsword down there. Where are we headed now? We need to go to the next point, which is over here. It's good just to clear these markers up. Because we will have to do it at some point. That's the way I see it. Oh, the drowners are here. Ugh. They're weird looking drowners. Ah, oh, remember the Witcher 1 guys going through all the swamps? It'll be almost a year since I did that playthrough now, since I started The Witcher 1, which means I've been sort of every single week, part like maybe missing, I missed like maybe 
altogether like two weeks out of that, maybe two parts I sort of missed once. Uh, and I used to actually do a few parts a week, didn't I? I used to do like... Th oh, God. Uh, 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 uh. Right, let's get the pirates. Yarr, har, diddly dee. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 God. 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 I'm so low. There needs to be a really good pirate game, doesn't there? Like a Witcher pirate game. There, there is Black Flag, Assassin's Creed, but I mean like just a proper pirate game. Like a, a fantasy pirate game, if you know what I mean. You know, kind of like... Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. They... they they return to the villages, don't they? They're like, oh, thank you. Yeah. I do like this armor, though. I think this armor's awesome. Hey, level 10. One more level, guys. One more. God, we got more money off that one guy than that entire... Hidden treasure, inverted commas. Right, let's drop some of the terrible swords. Unless there's a merchant here. There is a herbalist. What? Uh, what are you offering? Got you never know, I might have the swallow stuff. Doubt it, though. Dwarven spirit. Uh, some decoctions. Don't... Oh, we can sell our hide to this guy. Where's our hide? It's not in here. I think it's in crafting, isn't it? We may as well sell the gold. I don't think we really need gold for anything. Significant sum? He's giving me nine gold for them. Will it? Will, will hide just be in crafting? I'm going to go with yes. No. Junk? Food and drink. Other? Oh, yeah, there's my hide. So, I can't sell him the hide. But, he can sell me hide. That is ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, that's right, Geralt. You tell him. Right, well, we we, we probably got to get rid of more of these swords, then, if we can't sell anything. Okay. Let's have a look at the world map. We have another few question marks to do. There's one. Might even swim out to that little island over there, grab it. Do I actually have any um, signboards I haven't done in Velen yet? There's one right down there, and then other than that, we've got every other signboard. And then Novigrad, I'd say, is up past this area, once that's really Velen -y anymore. Like, Vel Velen is in the area of the game, Velen. You know, the crones and all that. I know technically Novigrad is in the same bit, but you know what I mean. Okay. Whoa, these guys are actually really low level. I can probably just... Your turn. Right, we got them all. Let's see if this gives us anything decent. Probably not. Some smuggler's notes. Those were the days you'd smuggle a few bottles of hooch into Oxenfurt, then loiter about the dormitory selling it to students. You'd come away with a hefty sack of coin, and then they'd have their spirits fortified for study. Then along came Radovid, who shut down the university, chased the students away, and positioned Ballista on the riverbank to sink everything floating up or down the pontar, swans included. But there's not been a dark cloud yet that didn't have a silver lining. Yesterday I saw our brave soldiers sink a merchant vessel. Went straight to the bottom, it did. Uh, it went straight to the bottom, it did. Along with its whole crew and its cargo. A shame about the men, really. But it would, uh, but it would just as big a shame. But it would just, this is terrible English. But it would just as big a shame to let all those goods go to waste. So me and Martin will fish them out, dry them off and sell them. And maybe at last I'll have something to put m in my pot. Oh, why is this a red? Wait there. Is there going to be like a horrible monster here? Oh, it looks like there might be a horrible monsters here. 
I mean, it doesn't look that sunk. It's kind of annoying how I can't jump up this. Can I, can I like, glitch onto, like, a little bit here? Nope, looks like I'm swimming. What level are the drowners to give me the red? God, it's like... I was going to say it's like shooting fish in a barrel, but it's a little bit harder. Yeah, you know, I'm going to have to aim this a bit better, I think. See, this will save time. We're diving. Thank God underwater combat is made easier. Where is this treasure? Oh, it's like round, okay. Whoa, we got so much cool stuff. What was that we got? A worse silver sword. Oh, it's the exact same silver sword I have now. Not not good, though. Must be some other stuff down here, right? Oh, come on, there can't be one chest on the ship. That is not how transport works. Hey, screw you. Yeah, that's right. I'm not sure if a crossbow would work this effectively underwater, to be completely honest. But we'll go with it. Just checking if there's anything else. I don't think there is. Wow, that was terrible. I mean, it was better than the other one. I'm giving that. Still terrible. How many other marks are there? I think the next one's actually on an island, so... We may as well just swim there from where we are. Please just leave me alone, Drowner. I just want to... I just want to swim. There is a lot of ships around, actually, that are sunken. Maybe, maybe we could sort of, you know... Is that a chest over there, sunken? Doesn't look like it. There is a chest down there. Wow, what treasures. Anything under here? I feel like there should be some cool stuff in these bits, you know? If, if I'm going to the effort of diving down... Oh, there is a red thing. Whoa! Whoa, there was, there, was, there was actually a cool thing there. Should I check all these ships? Oh, I can't get out. Okay. Um, don't really think there's much... Right. Go away. I didn't mean to fire two. <laughs> uh, oh god, I, I, it's so difficult to like navigate under here. I think we're about to drown, aren't we? Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, it's fine. So that's the one we were just at. We found another one. Oh my god, drowner, please stop. You know what? Oops. Okay, I, I definitely was trying to use the crossbow for about five minutes there, but whatever. I don't know... Surely that red thing must have been some sort of, you know, prompt. Was it this? Ugh. A wraith, really? Oh my god, it's level 15. Wait there. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ah! Pranked. Didn't mean to do that. Uh. Oh, God. God, I wish I had like a much bigger ear den, like just a massive area, you know, it'd be so convenient. Oh, you know what, actually, I th I think the, um, what is it called, the Mundus bombs are really good against these guys. I'm just going to have to actually hit it, which, although, right that way there. Did I hit it? I hit it! Wait, 
with that. We killed it! Oh, and we used bombs too! Oh, the moon just bombs are the best. Sorry, I was so quiet there. I was, I did, I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Right, we did it. Sweet. Enhanced thunderbolt. Not bad. Oh, enhanced thunderbolt's actually pretty good. Let's check. Can we make anything actually? Let's have a look. Potions down here. So we do have everything for cat now, which is good. We have everything for enhanced thunderbolt. Nice. Oh, why not? We'll make cat. So now we actually have the better Thunderbolt. I say we put Thunderbolt, or at least Enhanced Thunderbolt, uh, where Black Blood currently is, because we don't... It's kind of a bit of a specific one, isn't it? And another thing I actually just remembered as I'm doing that is I never actually did the perk. Um, I never picked a perk for um, my level 10 level up, so maybe I'll have a look at that. I'm thinking of actually specking into potions a bit, or maybe maybe just general weaponry sort of damage. I think quick attacks, maybe increasing how much damage they do might be useful. I don't know, I feel like going into signs is useful too, considering I don't really have any red mutagens either, do I? I wonder if I can make any from anything I've gathered. How do I check? Greater red mutagen. We can't even make normal red mutagens. Oh no, we can. What's it made from? Lesser red mutagen. Can we deconstruct any alchemical things to make lesser red mutagens? If you know what I mean. Uh, like if I... I don't think so. I, I don't know why we would be able to. Nah, don't think so. Okay, well we did that. That was cool. Defeat level 15 Noonwraith. Use bombs too. Quite proud of that to be honest. Because I'm usually... I mean, you saw how terrible I was last time. Oh, I thought it was like a little chest. Just a plant. <laughs> the most disappointing... Oh, it's, it m might be a treasure chest filled with gold or maybe another crappy Nothergrad sword. Oh no, it's just a crate filled with ashes or a, a chest filled with sulfur. Superior Dragon's Dream. I think we already have original Dragon's Dream, so that's cool. I think we do need enhanced first, though. Uh, maybe we'll get it eventually. Do, I swear there was one more boat we still haven't been to. Oh, wait. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Ah, too quick. God, how many are there? This is ridiculous. Right, like that. Okay, this is actually getting dumb now with that. There's still more, really? Ugh. Okay, I'll deal with. It doesn't look like there's anything down here. So that was all just worthless. Okay, how many drowners? Seriously, are you kidding me? I think we looted every boat here. Um, I think we might have missed one, but I can't be bothered to go and mess about. For some reason, I still have underwater volume. Oh, there we go. Uh, just check if there's anything just hanging around here. Doesn't really look like it, to be honest. Uh, some... Oh, dimeritium! See, there you go, guys. And that's what it's all for. Is there a marker on this beach? It looks like there's a lot of bandits here. Right, I guess we're gonna have to really go for this. Oh, God, this is not gonna be good. Okay, there is a bandit camp. This is a big old bandit camp. Oh, and a hit. Okay, it's both of them then. Yikes. Oh. That was definitely supposed to be an Igni. With that. How did that not... Wait there. 
I suppose so. Ooh. Oh my god. Ow. I, I'm trying to get the crossbow guy to hit his own guys. That's why I'm not killing him straight away. Come on, get this guy. Get this guy. Come on. Sorry, man. No more of that. Right, let's get the next ones. Uh. God, so slow. Uh. So I'm gonna kill this guy just because it's gonna be annoying. Oh, that would that was almost a. Uh... Oh, 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 oh. I thought I had way more health than I did. Uh. Okay, is this the last guy? I think it's the last guy. Ugh. Okay. All dealt with. Oh my god, that was not easy. That was a lot of... clicky. You know? It was not that the enemies were necessarily hard, it was the fact there's so many of them. Numbers overwhelm. There is a little note here. Yesterday, we found a silver basin and a ruby brooch on the bottom. It means Queen Zuleika, Zuleika's treasure really is somewhere around here. Maybe in the hold of one of the ship wreck ships off the west coast. But we can't check them at the moment. Waves are too high. We'll have to wait until the seas calm down. Uh, we're pitching a camp. Cool. Well, we'll go for that one. I can't track the quest. Is it because I picked up too much stuff? Oh yeah, we found you saw, didn't we? Much better. Um, wow. That one does more damage. Oh, but the, I think this the one I'm using right now is better. I need to repair my armor now. What shoes did I just drop? Hang on. Hang on. I need those. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> Um, I actually think I prefer the Skelligan outfits for going to dinners and things in this game. I think it looks cool. Oh yeah, we've got to equip the other quest, don't we? What's her faces thing? The treasure of... Oh! Oh, did it not, not let us do it because... Oh, that must have been the red thing we found. Oh, okay, well that's cool anyway. So we cleared that marker. We still have the actual bandit camp marker to deal with. Which I think was up here or something. Is there more enemies? Yeah, there's a couple more. Okay, okay, it's fine. I'm gonna kill the bow guy, he's annoying. Whoa! Uh, avoided. Huh. Right, dealt with. Um, fist tech, little chest with barely anything in it. Well, there was a few decent things. Oh, right. Well, that's done. Now there's still another chest to get. Dwarven Spirit, and... Oh my god. Arbiter? It's a cool sword name. That silver sword is way better than my current one. It's exactly the same, but it's just a higher level, I guess. Find a lot of duplicate swords in this. I kind of don't want to drop that. I say we drop some of the 
many pairs of trousers we've acquired. Sort of some of the terrible gauntlets. This is worth keeping, I think, just to sell. We could wear it, but I prefer the armor I've got. I feel like I've sort of, you know, I took quite a lot of time getting this armor. Right, we've really got to go and start selling things, I think. I kind of want to finish all the markers here first, though, just because I've... Oh, have I finished them all? I still have, like, that one, that one, and those to mid-copes. And then I'll do those ones a bit later, I think. Because we still want to return to Kira today and at least do that. Um, I was actually going to stop soon, but maybe I'll do another 20 minutes just to finish. Because I'm not sure how much of this I'm going to cut out, because there has been a lot of just swimming around and fighting. I think I'll do the other Kira thing too. How many missions have I done today? I did, I did that one about the pester, and then I... I did... I guess, I guess I've done all the sort of mini missions today. Like, a lot of mini missions. A lot of these marks. It's good just to clear an area, though, even if it takes a little while. You know, get, get it done. Get it done. And get loads of cool stuff and level up a bit. Oh, am I going to have to swim across somewhere, I guess? Have I got my marker in the right place? Yeah, I just got there really much more quickly than I thought I would. Oh my god, a giant dead whale. I want to eat the whale. He's mine. Show me what you got. I'm joking, I would never eat a whale. That'd be horrible. A dolphin on the other no, I'm joking. I I'm, I'm not I'm not into that sort of thing. Ugh. Dealt with. Come on. Just fight me. I know I'm going to have to fight you in five seconds anyway. Fire the freaking crossbow, Geralt. I hate this. They know how to abuse game mechanics, so I'll give Drowners that. Okay. We spent a lot of today just crossbowing drowners underwater, haven't we? Weirdly, I can't find any of their remains. I guess they didn't drop anything. Enhanced Torniel. We're getting way too much stuff here. It's worth 36. That's worth 33. That's worth 36. And that's worth 48. So I guess we get rid of this. Uh, I kind of want to keep all my Nilfgaardian things. I'll take the better hunting gauntlets, I guess. Um, I don't think other stuff weighs that much. I know the hides weigh quite a lot, but they're worth quite a lot. Look at that. Psh. And he's going to sell some of those, I think. I'll do it after this. I'll do it. I may as well get some of the swords. They're not going to be worth much. It's already broken, too. Okay. This place has been... Oh! Was that Enhanced Tawny Owl as well? I just realised. What am I missing here? Verbena and Arrakis Venom. So it's like a white flower. I guess we'll keep an eye out for that one. Um, I guess the next one is this, and then this, then this, then there. That's not going to take too long, guys. We'll just quickly swim it. Oh! Then we just head back, and we do it on the way back. And then in mid-copes, we'll sell all our stuff. Oh, mid mid-scope? It's a difficult one to say, that one. <laughs> but, no, I don't know. I feel like we're doing quite a lot. I'm enjoying it. Right, I want to replenish my Mundus bombs as well. I feel like they're useful. I'll get better at the bombs, I promise. Yeah, not letting you get me there, bro. Okay. So it's under here somewhere. Usually, uh, it looks like it's over there, doesn't it? I think I can just about make it out. What is that? There's a thing over there. Hmm. Oh my god, really? Is that it? Some, some alcohol? I think the game's detected that I've done way too many of these. Right. Well, we killed the drowner. We did that thing. We just have to quickly head up before we drown. We have to readjust our marker. 
We've done quite a lot of them, though, you know, and it doesn't take that long. I think the reason it's taking me a little bit longer is because I'm not using roach as much as I should. Because with roach, you can just sort of get there. And also, there has been a lot of water ones, and they do seem to take a lot longer because you've got to, like, swim all the time, and swimming's really slow. If I think a call roach before I get to the shore, then she's there when I arrive, you know? Because after the... I think next time I might even be able to move on to the Baron bit, but then I'm going to just have to go and do all the question marks in this lower area of Velen. It's pretty much... A anything lower than the Pontar is what I've got to do. Lucky day. At least as best I can. Oh my god, I was trying to quen for so long, but I was stuck on bloody roach. Oh, there's so many. Oh, wait there. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I don't know how I'm going to avoid all these various crossbows. Wait there. Oh my god, that oh, they crossbowed their own dude. Ugh. Oh my god. Well, right, he's dead. What's up, guys? Oh, devastation! Right, now screw all of you. Whoa. The village of Cross. That guy looks so much like Geralt in the front. <laughs> Oh, just very briefly, it looked just a little bit like him, didn't it? Ah, oh, well, Geralt's happy. He's, he feels like he's accomplished something there. Uh, dumpling. A mug. Ah, oh, I need to start getting rid of some of these mugs, I think. Uh, I probably did. Oh, I don't know if I can be really bothered to loot all these guys, you know. I, I, I think I think they're pretty terrible enemies. See, I got a crown. Can I loot this village to high hell? I did save the village. I feel like I, I'm owed everything they have. That's how it works. Oh, I might get some Arrakis Venom if they have that, because I don't think I can be bothered to mess around with that. And it, it would be useful to have that sort of now, you know. Um... Okay, that'll do. I think we loot enough. Let's go to this herbalist. Just check if he wants to play some Gwent or something. There is something behind here. Ooh. Nice. Oh, we can barely move. I need to sell some stuff, but I, I don't know where. Got any... Like, as in, this guy barely accepts anything that I actually want to sell. Has he got any... He doesn't have any of the Venom stuff. What does it look like, the Arrakis Venom? It's just, it's just sort of like a bottle, isn't it? I don't think he has any. Annoying? I don't think I really have anything that I, I would like to sell. I kind of want to keep all my alchemical things. I, I do have, obviously, the hide the hiding stuff, but he's not going to accept that. I'm going to have to drop some in. <laughs> yeah, I love Geralt's reaction, because he knows. He knows we're just like, we just saved your village, and, you know, can't even sell anything, really. I'm going to have to drop that. Oh, Feels bad dropping swords and stuff, but I'm, I've run out of room, and I can't be bothered to mess about. Oh, you know what I'm going to quickly do, just because I keep on forgetting to do it. It is, of course, this. What did I do last time? I increased the threshold of my potion. Don't really care about oils or anything. Level 1 alchemical form increases the maximum. That seems kind of pointless for when I get higher than level 1. Is the next one... Um, I don't really need decoctions or anything. This is... Uh, I don't know. I feel like I should go for something with weaponry, you know. Right, we'll go for weaponry. I've been saying it for ages. I think I need to go for this. That's like my favorite one. Just basically, fast attacks are a bit better. I mainly use fast attacks. Arrow deflection is okay, because you can deflect arrows, but I... It's, it's very circumstantial. Like, this will work in every situation. So I'm going for that. I know, I should probably do the same for red on one bit, green another, and so on, but I, you know what? Screw it. Today we're doing that. Let's see what this next marker is. Oh, more bandits. Okay. quickly deal with them. I'm not going to mess about with this one. I'm just going to deal with them. 
Break his stamina. Keep breaking his stamina. That's bad. Am I? Sorry guys, I was I didn't want to mess about with that one too much. Just a quick boom boom boom. And then we'll return to Kira. Oh god damn it. Stop giving me good stuff, game. <laughs> uh it's worth more, isn't it? Um We're really running out of stuff to drop. I, I guess this. I don't know why we have that. I swear I dropped that actually. Kinda wanna keep the Nilf Guardian stuff. That's worth a bit, that's worth a bit, that's worth quite a bit, that's worth quite a bit. The armor's always worth more, but I guess it does weigh more. Uh we have a bunch of Do we have it okay, can we drop any of this terrible like mugs and stuff like that? We could drop the terrible wine glass. How much is pig hide worth? All of the hide is worth quite a lot. I guess the rope ladders. I mean that's 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 worth a bit, you know, but we'll leave it. We don't need it. Oh my god, we're getting so much stuff. Right, is that all the markers done? In this section, they're all done. How many have we got left? We have this one, that one, then that's... Sorry, these two, then that one, and then I guess, like, those four. Then that's in that entire upper section, then just all the bottom ones. Which, it looks like I could just ride from one to the other pretty quickly in an episode. Uh, I'm not sure which episode... We're going to actually head into the village first, just to sell some of this stuff, because I keep on having to drop stuff now, which is not good. Um, we have even more oil stuff. Don't really use oils, so yet again, not, not that useful, but... I don't know. I feel like you've got to spec for certain things in The Witcher as best you can. Like, you can't really go for full sign, full potion, full sword. You can kind of do a bit of all of them, but you'll never quite... You'll just have to... It means you have to do more, you know? Which seems kind of pointless. Cool. Um, I need to sell you a lot of my crap. Okay, so, stuff we no longer need. We no longer need that. Take it. We no longer need that. And we no longer need that. And as for this one, we also don't need Moonblade. Uh, we also don't really need this. We don't really need this armor. Um... Don't need that, but I don't think you can afford anything else. Any th th crap thingy you can just buy for cheap? Ugh, right. Tell you what, we'll check it. Has he got any diagrams or anything? Nothing really that we want to buy from him. Okay, thank you. I've got to sell my hide to somebody now. I'll work it out. There's a merchant over here. Tell you what, we'll sell all our hides now, because that stuff does weigh quite a lot. Amulet. Hello. What else you have? Corpse tea. Let's sell it all. It's good getting money in this game, you know. You, you slowly build it up. So hide time. So we have seven of these. It's quite a lot. Six of those. Four of those. Some flesh that we don't really need. And then he can't buy any of those. We can sell our other stuff to him. Um. Yeah, why not? We'll sell them all our mugs and things. So, like two of those. Right, we do kind of need another merchant to sell the rest of this stuff to because we still have a lot of stuff. I mean, our carry weight's pretty down now, but it's still high. Maybe Kira will buy some um, herbalist stuff. Sorry, I'm just assuming where she is. I think she's up here somewhere. Right. So what we're going to say? We're going to sell Kira what we can. We're going to complete this quest for her. Then we're going to do the next bit. Um, and then we'll get to Fai Kyle. And then potentially we might even stop there. Or I could even do Forefather's Eve thing. Carry on the episode just a bit longer. Won't take me long to do those two things. Then I, you know, next time I can maybe even visit the Baron straight away. Or make the armor. Because I'm pretty close now. 
I've just been stockpiling money and resources for ages. Hello, Kira. Geralt, just when I was starting to miss you. Uh, very quickly. I just want to sell you some of my stuff. She doesn't accept any of my hides, annoyingly. I could sell her some of these rune stones, I guess. Mm, we'll leave it. Okay, there you go. Got those uh, substances you wanted? Splendid. I can finally begin my study of double arboreal racination patterns. But first, I'll bring yourself a mug of mulled wine. Saw what the wagon was carrying: exquisite meats, expensive wines, Zeracanian spices. Not a speck of magic. Care to tell me what you're up to? I would rather show you, but you must wait a bit. Color me intrigued. Fine, I'll wait. <laughs> then shoo, outside. Gonna slip into something more comfortable? Later. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Well, go on, out. You've been patient, thank you. It's almost ready. Huh? If I wanted to see white mice, I'd just get drunk. Note that I said almost. Now don't interrupt. The cane within Kapel. Yeah, what happened to- oh, I know. Mouse. What happened to it? The spell has a 66.67% chance of success. I always use one more than I need, just in case. So where did- Kira, can I explain what's going on here? Know the fairy tale about Cinderella? Mm-hmm. True story it's based on, too. A zoogle cropped up in a palace pond and ate Princess Cinderella whole. Left behind one slipper, so- I beg you, not another word about zoogles. Now to return to the fairy tale, I'd like to escape these ghastly swamps for one magical night. I don't need a fairy godmother, I'll cast the spells myself, but I could use a Prince Charming. It just so happens you're the only decent candidate in all Velen. So, what do you say to a moonlight ride on horseback? And dinner? <laughs> Gigolo. I'm a witcher, not a gigolo. <laughs> don't flatter yourself. I don't want to shag you in the bushes, but to share a pleasant evening. But if no, then no. Oh, all right. I'll do it. I feel honored. Truly. Before we go, there's one more thing. Gonna transform a pumpkin into a carriage? No. I shall transform our rancid rags into something more glamorous. Don't wince. It'll only be an illusion, won't hurt a bit. And at dawn, everything will return to normal. Uh, why not? Why not? Might as well go all out. Then hold on tight. Gavella Glan. <laughs> the spell that does everything. <laughs> so, what do you think? Neckline too modest? It's just right. Oh, I might also have changed your hair colour while I was at it. I've always fancied dark-haired men. Oh well, any port in a storm. Well, off we go. Dinner's waiting. Last one there does the dishes. Oh, I'm not gonna lose. What? This isn't fair. There was no countdown, Kira. You can't do that. <laughs> I have to win. Wait, hold on. Can I select the quest? Um... There you go. Just cut some corners. I know it's a bit cheaty, but whatever. Oh, I feel like I shouldn't go too off course, though, you know? Might have been a better idea. Oh, my God. On our lovely night out, there is a guy there just hanging. Hanging around. Oh, no, 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 no. Go on, horse of stamina. Give Glan. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm just sort of considering what to do with this next bit, and I, th I know what I'm going to do. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure I know what I'm going to do. Right. Normally I just skip all this. Oh, no. Kira, don't overtake me. 
It's not allowed. Okay, we're there, we're there. Sweet. Congratulations, you'd make an excellent jockey. If only I were a foot shorter and five stone lighter. Well, yes, but then I'd not have invited you here. Now do you see why I needed those substances? Um, it, it was worth the trouble. Could have told me. <laughs> Could have just told me what this was about, Rhino. <laughs> Geralt, run to the woods and fetch my shopping. I'd like to make dinner. Well, would you have helped? If I'd known I'd get a glass of Zubaran dry in return, of course. Well, well, never took you for a wine connoisseur. Think witchers suck the marrow out of drowner bones and wash it down with puddle water? More or less. Well, we've chatted long enough on empty stomachs. Let's dig in. Must have cost you a small fortune. Sure you don't need me to pitch in? Please, I manage. You know, a dozen eggs here, a cockogander there. Besides, my finances are about to improve. All right, I'm curious. We celebrating something? Yes, a return to the living. But that's not what I wish to discuss. Thank you once again, Geralt, for your help with the tower. You were fabulous. Not the first curse I've lifted. But among the most difficult, correct? What happened on that island? Why I shiver at the thought. And the laboratory. I sincerely hope you burnt everything. The cages, the corpses, the papers. Uh, why are you even interested? Because I grasp the importance of the studies conducted there. In the wrong hands, the findings could do immense harm. <laughs> I'm sorry. Such a gloomy subject to broach. I simply shouldn't have, not during our romantic dinner. Romantic? Thought we came here as friends. Friends. With benefits. So? Don't have to ask me twice. <laughs> ba -ba -ba -da -ba. No, uh, none in the mood. Sorry, there's someone else. There is someone else, everyone. There's Yennefer. We said, didn't we, in The Witcher 2, we'll be fine with sleeping with Triss in The Witcher 2 because Geralt doesn't know any better, but now he's got Yennefer and he's got his memories back. I, I feel like with our Geralt, you know, it's it's just Yennefer now. That's that's how it's going. And you never know, we could switch back to Triss later on. Feel feelings of our Geralt could re-emerge. <laughs> but sorry, not not Kira. I'm sorry, Kira. Sorry, there's someone else. <laughs> so what? Oh, Geralt, Geralt. You're so old-fashioned. Will you at least lie down and gaze at the stars with me? Hmm. <laughs> Why not? Know what they call that constellation in Zeracania? Dragon something, I bet. <laughs> no. It has a different name. A bit indecent, actually. Lean closer and I'll whisper it in your ear. Ekvain Nave. Kira? Where? Put me to sleep with a spell. Means she's up to something. Ah, Fike Isle. The tower. I find it weird that Kira even in you know, well, why would she bother inviting Geralt, if you know what I mean? Oh, I'll have to do that one later. But, as in like, why not just say, okay Geralt, cheers for the, um, how do I, why can't I, okay. Cheers for the, um, God, sorry, I can't bloody speak. Cheers for the help with the tower but l l let's 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 leave it now you know what i mean l l i'll see you later and then she could have just gone to the tower dealt with it and then Geralt would have you know he would never have known but she decided to go and do the tower af after spending a night with him i don't know maybe she kind of wants to be caught sort of thing i i it's a weird one i'm gonna fast travel over there with the signboards i'm not gonna bother s using the boat almost at the signpost yeah, we do actually have a mission over there somewhere, so I, I guess we'll do that one after. If there's any missions that I'm missing, be sure to tell me. Someone else said that I 
there's another way that you get the the question marks as opposed to just signboards. You're going to have to remind me of that, so someone tell me in this part. I'll, I'll have a look, actually, as well, but if you want to tell me, feel free. Right. Okay. Major decision, right. so... Okay, here we are. So, found what you were looking for? Yes, thanks for asking. How are you feeling? Sleep well? What's with the notes? What do you want with those papers? Why, I aim to use them to continue important work that a man's tragic death put on hold. Alexander was studying the Catriona Plague. I'll use his notes to produce medication, perhaps a cure, or at least a vaccine. Mm -hmm. Strictly humanitarian motivations, is that it? No, strictly selfish ones. The mighty would pay willingly for such a remedy. Can you imagine how much? Take Radovid, for instance. Why, he might even consider forgetting my past associations with the Lodge. Uh, I don't think Radovid is ever going to forget. <laughs> and I don't think he really cares. I'm going to say that. Radovid doesn't forget, and Radovid doesn't forgive, especially when it comes to sorceresses. He'll make an exception for me. He'll have to. I have something he wants. Please, you don't believe that. Well, you believe Yennefer will stop treating you like a dog someday. Don't see me laughing. I actually I'm don't. <laughs> Tell him of this research, whether you like it or not. Uh, can't let you do that. It's suicide. This is suicide, Kira. You'll wind up tied to a stake, burned to bolster the morals of the masses while entertaining them. Shut up for a moment and look at me. See this? Bed bugs, Geralt. Bloody bed bugs. I, Kira Metz, advisor to Foltest, a member of the Lodge of Sorceresses, have bed bugs. Think what you will, but I'll not stay in this bloody swamp one day more. Not one day. I shall cross the Pontar, and that means Radovid's men will find me sooner or later. Don't you understand? I don't have a choice. I will have to parley. Go to Care Morn. Nah. Got another option. Go to Care Morhen. You believe I'd be safe there? As long as you don't piss Lambert off, yes. Amir, Radovid, neither will be able to reach you. Find little in the way of luxury there, but we do have clean sheets. It's a long way, well beyond the dividing line. But if I keep to the woods until I reach the Kestrel Mountains, I should pass through unnoticed. So be it. Seems I find it hard to refuse you, handsome. You've clearly a notion of what women want, how they think. Um, so I can say, see you at Care Morn, or before I go, the notes, I'll take them. Mm, I'm going to have to have a quick think about this one, actually. Um... Oh, God. So pretty much, guys, I think I literally can just say, go to Care Morn, or you have the notes. I'm pretty sure it does not matter if I take the notes or not, because I think either way, something cool with the plague and all that happens at the end with Kira, I, d I don't think it matters, but... I, I kind of don't see why I shouldn't let her have the notes. I'm not going to use them, but I I think to be safe, I, I sort of shouldn't let her have them, you know, just just in case. Ugh. I don't know. I think I kind of... I think I'll... Oh, God, this is horrible. I'm, I'm just going to take the notes. Fuck it. I'm yeah, taking them. I'm taking kinda. them. So before I go... I'll need you to hand me those notes. All right, all right. Take them already. Farewell, Geralt. Or rather, see you soon. See you, Kira. Oh, God. I, 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 I know it doesn't matter at all, but I kind of just like... Do I... Should I have taken the notes or not? 
Oh, I should have repaired my armor earlier, shouldn't I? Oh well. The reason I actually decided to do all that was because... I completed the quest. Wait for that to update. Can I go in the pole? Nope. So there is also the other quest, which is like Forefathers Whatever. Um, so we may as well actually do that. We'll get there and we'll just rest briefly. Oh, do I have to fight more ghouls? Oh, they've all respawned. I just killed them all. I'm just going to run past them. So, right, we got Kira at Kaer Morn. That's good. We still have the Fall of House Reardon, which I may even do, like, next time or something. We'll see. I think I'm going to do this last quest, and then that's it for today. Because, you know what? I feel like I'm here. I don't want to end on Fike Isle again. Or start on Fike Isle again next time. I want to sort of start in a new area. I feel like it's been way too much time here. Um, we'll wait till midnight. We will get, like, a full thing on all our potions as well, won't we? Now I think about it. I just have to remember to sell my stuff next time. That's the main reason I'm sort of like, hmm. And also repair my armor. People are really annoyed about the big red mark on the screen. That's that's what a lot of people are saying. But you know what? I'll, I'll, I'll repair it next time, guys. I'm, no, there's no point, actually. I'm going to get new armor really soon. Like, really soon. Maybe just a waste of money. Behold the one who will protect us. You needn't fear. Soon shall we summon the wandering sub. Beyond all help, some will be. From these, you must protect us. Evil creatures keep at bay. Keep at bay till the ritual's done. We'll dig in. Keep us from harm, and let them not disturb the circle. What is this life? Well, you know. Let's go. What comes next once life subsides? Mind is all the Soon will rise thy dead, thy buried. It's all safe, I hope they're hurried. Will ye grant these souls reprieve? The storm will prepare to end their grief. Let's begin for Father's Eve. Gotta kill these drowners, guys. It's fine. Hark! A sound I hear. Tis right. The spirit breaks the still of night. Burn the incense ever higher. Spirit, join us round the fire. Spirit, speak. This time is yours. Tell us of your ghostly woes. Oh. Who are you? He knows. Papa. Should I drive him away? No. I've come for you, Patricide. Be gone, foul force. I cast upon you the light of the eternal fire. Abomination. Stop this at once. The errant souls. We must help them. Silence. I'll not tolerate necromancy. Help me. Leave now. You're disrupting the ritual. This is black magic. These folk disturb the dead. We cannot allow it. We will not. You don't know a thing about their customs. Take him and disperse the others. You can try it. Oh. 
This is annoying with that. Is an intern. You. Why were we? Why were we? Why the hallowed ground? Yet we cannot stop what has begun. The bloodshed. It do any harm? Tainted lies the circle now. They who thirst for the gore of men shall come. God's willing, they will be few, and the pillar shall finish the right. If you want to continue, I'm ready. Good folk, we must the eve complete. Prepare yourselves. Ye we summon, ye we call. Enter souls, we'll judge ye all. All is well, all is soon. We will be Something whispers, something peeps. Someone near our fire creeps. All is quiet. All is Oh, brilliant. The ground is with blood stained. We cannot the ritual complete. People, save yourselves. If your lives you value, run. Oh, God. Okay, they're all dealt with. Alas, all is lost. Hmm, gotta be a peasant who told the witch hunters about the ritual. That spirit they drove away. Your father's ghost, right? Threatened to come back, likely to keep his word. Old man Ambros, the Pella fears not. That wraith called you a patricide. He get it right? Aye. If I'm gonna help you, I gotta know everything. Why'd you kill your father? The Pella does not wish to speak of this. You can't hope to manage this alone. You're afraid, that's clear. Wraith will hold sway over you. Listen, I'll send him off. I've got to. But I need to know where he's buried. Corpse probably hasn't turned to dust yet. That's his bond to the world of the living. Ambrose lies in the swamp. Fine. I'll find his body, see what I can do. Cool. Right, we'll quickly loot these guys. Then we'll um, go to the swamp, do the body thing, and we'll end. At least we're not ending on Fike Isle. I did not want to end here again. I don't know, I always feel weird ending in the same place. I, I, don't, I know I did it with the, uh, what is it, the Baron thing? But, you know, whatever. Just quickly loot everything. I wish there was, like, a loot all in the area button, you know? That'd be useful for monsters. Guess not very realistic, though. Right. We'll be quick. So, I say we travel to, like, a village quickly. We could even repair our armor quickly, because I know you guys are going to get annoyed by that. Um, <laughs> some of you will, at least. So, I'll, I'll quickly do that, but we'll see. Okay. So, you know what we could do, actually? We could just get on a boat and travel to a port, which means I don't have to deal with those ghouls. So, I could just do this. I guess it's the other way? Yeah. Come on, Geralt. You don't have to walk that slowly, mate. Okay, that world map. Uh, the nearest port to there is nowhere. But we could just get a port to... Or a harbour to a place with a signpost near it. I just look, guys, and it'd probably be quicker if I just quickly boat ride over there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to boat ride over there, skip the journey for you, and then we'll just quickly be at the swamp. I'm not going to bother with the armour repairing. I'm almost level 11. Okay, everyone, we have arrived. That took quite a little while, actually. Maybe, like, five minutes or something. 
maybe less. I actually just realized something, which I'll tell you after I've just quickly meditated, because I don't like it being nighttime. Um, which I'm going to quickly have a look at. And I just remembered that I probably have a bunch of armor repair kits on me. On maybe not loads, but uh, there. There you go. So now that's gone. There you go, guys. <laughs> no more. I should have done that way before. I just completely forgot. All right, we'll kill all the enemies. Come on. If I can just kill one, it should just chain kill them. Okay, wait there. Hang on. Let me kill this guy. Come on. Ooh, uh. Well, there's the dad. Swamps kept Ambrose's body in good shape. Hmm. Even where the Peller smashed his head in, got incinerated. I mean, didn't the Peller kill his dad like a long time ago? Never return again. Right, and now we've got to return to the Pella, and then that's that's it. That's it. We've recorded for an extra long time today, but you know what, guys? I feel like maybe maybe you've all earned it. Maybe, maybe, maybe you've earned the long part, because I did miss last week's. So it, I've recorded for like an extra half an hour, maybe more. Uh, way more. Well, like an extra 40 minutes nearly. So we'll see how much I end up cutting out. I have done quite a bit, though, today. I have um, did the Pester Quest in full... I did the Kira quest in full, and I'm nearly finished the Pella quest in full. I'm not going to bother fighting the Drowners. This is very reminiscent of The Witcher 1, now I think about it. Running through these sort of swampy plains with Drowners spawning, I'm sort of having to run as best I can because I don't want to fight them, and they're chasing me. But then they, they give up, and then I run across these little paths. It does feel like a lot of this game mirrors The Witcher 1. You know what I mean? Like, you start in the swamp... Well, actually, you start in Care More, and then you go to the swamp. Then you end up in um, a city. And then that's pretty much it for The Witcher 1, isn't it? After the city, that's sort of where it ends. Whereas The Witcher 3 then goes from a city to Skellige, then back, then a bunch of other stuff. And then finally, um, how does it end, I guess? I guess th then you'd have the DLC and everything. But it, it's uh, there's a lot. And you get to go to different areas and things, and technically different worlds. It's a very good, good game, isn't it? Should I actually check if there's a quickie little... There, there is. I'm just going to quick sell some of my stuff while I can. God, I'm doing way more than I planned to. It's, it's mainly because I'm conscious that I know it's going to take so long to render this, and then absolutely ages to upload it, and I want to make sure I can get the part out to you guys in time. Um, because I've, I've been late sometimes when they're this sort of long, but I'll try my best. Show me what you... Hankering for some Gwent, mate. Now, we want to sell you all our stuff that we don't need, so... Four gold, why not? Seems like a good deal. Definitely not screwing me there. Right, where's all this hide? We just want to get rid of it. We'll sell all our other stuff too, like our pipes and dolls and bear stuff. And I kind of want to keep the ash just in case. Should have probably kept the vials. Oh well. Any dimeritium chains you keep. Right, that'll do. How much does that? That weighs quite a bit. No, it's fine. We got it. So this is actually a quest item. I'm not... Oh, I know what it's for. I'm not sure what the, um... Where's the bird skull I got? I got, like, a bird skull or something. Do you remember that? I got the bird thing. It was the stuff for Yennefer. Never actually did anything with that in the end. Tell me what I need that for, actually. I've completely forgotten. I know. Do I give it to her, I guess? Right, no. Anyway, we sold all that stuff. Let's go and see the Pella. We'll collect our rewards, or if he gives us one... And then finally, he might give us a bunch of potion things or stuff like that. It seems like this sort of guy. Uh, and then f finally, we will end today's part. 
which has been really long actually. Like really, I've been sat here for ages, but I really wanted to play The Witch today. I'm looking forward to when we get to Tucson the most. I don't know why. I just love that area. I, I absolutely love it. It feels like I'm on holiday. <laughs> it really does. It feels like normal Witcher is sort of day-to-day -day life, going about as a Witcher. I feel like I've experienced it for ages. Then Tucson is like just—it's like being on holiday. Oh, is that why sad? Is <laughs> what is it the wolf needs? Um, there you go. Found your father's body. I still burn. enjoy the normal day today, though, obviously. Return for me, he would have. What's your story? You actually kill your father? It was an evil man. The Pella feared him once, but then grew brave. What his father did to his mother, the Pella could not look upon it. So he split the father's head with an axe, left him in the swamp. But folk knew. Ghost's not likely to come back. Thank you, Witcher. A reward for your aid. And if herbs or remedies you ever need, for near nothing you will have them from me. Mm. What I get, what I get, what I get. Thank you, though. Um, I want to see what I got. A bunch of herbs, a bunch of things. I got some money. Oh, well. Money's good, I guess. You know, solid. Solid 50 crowns. I want to check if he has an enhanced swallow. I can't seem to find that anywhere. Could you? That's actually really good. We do need that for stuff later on, but not right now. Dwarven spirit, northern wind. Everyone sells bloody northern wind and dwarven spirit. Right, I guess we're done. So long. Okay. Right, guys, I'm going to end today's Witcher part there. I hope you've all enjoyed. It's been really fun. I'm sure you can tell I've actually recorded for longer than I normally would, and that's just because I've really enjoyed myself today, and it's been really fun. I, I genuinely love playing this game every week. It's, it's so fun. As always, guys, if you have enjoyed today's video, be sure to like it. It lets me know that you want this Witcher 3 playthrough to continue, and you're enjoying these sort of videos, and just supporting the channel and things. So if you want to make sure this playthrough continues, and you just want to help me out, be sure to like today's video. Also, thank you to every single one of you that subscribed. I imagine most of you will be subscribed if you're watching part 12 of a series, so thank you all for doing that. Also, be sure to join the Discord, Reddit, follow me on Twitter and Twitch. I'm sure you know all about that stuff. I'm sure most of you must anyway, just because, you know, you, you, you clearly support the channel by watching it and stuff, so thank you all so much. And finally, guys, as always, a big thank you to the Patreon pledges. You guys are honestly amazing. It's very, very kind what you do. I know some of you have honestly, like, you've been on every single list since my Witcher 1 lists, and that is just amazing. And then even anyone that's new or anyone that just chooses to support, I always just think, God, that's, that's such a kind person. So thank you to every single one of you. Thank you to everyone that comments, likes, all the rest. You're all amazing. But anyway, I hope you've all enjoyed today's video, and I'll see you in the next one. Have an awesome rest of the week.